Hi, I'm going to show you how to create a permission form for our class trip using Google Forms. First thing you want to do is go to Google Forms and open up a blank form. You want to give your class trip a title and you want to give them a description, the parents a description of what the trip is about. Then you can start adding questions of information you would like to collect. First question I always like to add is student name. I make this required. That means the parents have to answer this question in order to submit the form. I'm going to show you a Google form that has questions from a trip that I went to this year. Up at the top, I am able to uh, add a header. If you go to the art palette, you can customize your theme. Some of the questions I have put on here are parent name, parent email, parent cell, and you can see these all have a red asterisk. That means those questions have to be answered. And for parents to sign this, I put a statement as asking them to type their initials to give permission to go on the trip. If there is a question that may not the parents may not know the answer to, such as being a chaperone, this is a multiple choice question right now, um, and you'll see that there's no red asterisk. That means the parent does not have to answer this right now, but they can. And I also put a medical question at the bottom of mine. Uh, and this is a drop down. My child needs to, to take medication or my child does not need medication. And always check with the nurse to see that the information matches up. Then you have to go into settings. There's two things that you need to do here. So you click on the settings gear and you want to uncheck to restrict to just sentiments in township public schools. You want to be able to send this out to the parents. So you always uncheck that. And in presentation, you want to leave a little message saying thank you for filling out the permission form. Please send in a check for the uh, class trip with your child's name and your teacher's name. And make sure you hit save. And then you're ready to send this out to the parents. Uh, click on the link button. I like to shorten it, copy it. And this link, I will then put in a body of an email. In the email, I tell the parents about the trip, the date, uh, anything they might need for the trip. And I ask them to fill out this permission form by clicking this link. The parents will fill this out, and then they will send the money for the trip. Uh, to see their responses, once the parents start uh, responding, you will see this number starting to go up. A couple parents here have responded. So the information starts to collect in boxes for the different questions. But what I like to do, and I think this is really helpful, is to click on the Google Sheets button. And this will create a uh, spreadsheet for all the information that you that is being collected in your Google form. And I even add a little column over here. I put this in after this is created for payment. And you can keep track of the payments as well as, as you receive them. Um, this file updates and it can be found in Google Sheets once you create it. I hope you enjoyed this video and I find that having using Google Forms really cuts down on the amount of paperwork and the parents really enjoy it as well um, because the permission form is in their email. And I also put it in a, a Remind app as well so they can find it two different places. If you would like to see this Google form, check the comments below the YouTube video, and I put a link to this form so you can see exactly what it looks like. Thank you.